What's going on out this true? Yeah. Y'all know about them mattress boys then shit. Yeah, she watched she watched a lot of mafia movies then. Let's get straight to the point. Uh why they ain't taking a uh, recess. Um these are my keynotes. Let y'all know I'm back, I'm paying attention, I'm safe and good. Uh, as you can see when you see that popcorn selling. Safe house. All right. These are my notes. Number one. Remember when I got the Texas license plate? Well, it's just day three and I ain't finished it. When I got the, taste, the Texas license plates, the Texas license plate, I could have sworn they just told us they had like plates in the back of the car from all different states, right? So, yeah, just remember that somebody um, led me to go dig in the ditch. So I want that to stand now because, see, as the evidence come out, I'm just being, taking my L's, taking my strength, right? That Texas license plate, if if they already, if I already came out of the trial that they had, right, for Illinois, Mississippi, yeah, they do this one out. So we can check that out. Next question. Um, did Straight Dropper Cornelius contact Juke or go in because they say they spotted they was out they were finna go to Westwood for a turkey drive just catching any one of the PR members so when they spotted Dolph did they contact Juke or go in alright these are just notes before they pick it back up um, let me see I wrote this shit on brown bag y'all don't want to leave it um okay if Govan is, is going to testify on the straight drop, because it's straight drop trial, and Cornelius already took the stand and, and, and told on Govan, how is Govan, what kind of witness would Govan be at straight drop's trial if Cornelius already threw him under the bus? These are just key notes. Uh, number four, why the judge took a recess? at a critical moment in this trial when they when they was giving us the um, timeline of the route they took. That's number four. Number five, don't never forget. Why was Robin got his sister called at 7 30 in the morning on November 17th and told to send everybody home the morning before 7.30 a.m. They ain't get dogs until noon or some shit. Why, why was that happening? Why that happen? Right? Man, bro. My phone rang. I just want to make sure y'all hear me. All right. All right. So why was Ray Robin told to shut down daycare that morning? And then on the same day... Another step before uh, Big Head posted an ominous message talking about some shit like he knew what was up. If he don't know what's up, right? All right. Um, uh, it's just day three. But why we don't hear Teaser's name on day three when you're always seeing Teaser and Drop? like drop was second in command or something. We seen teachers see drop all the videos, all the back and the front and everything. Uh, I ain't heard teaser name yet, right? Um, Marcus, yep, I seen you, my boy. He came out busting. Uh, yeah, so we'll get to the apology, the apology uh, you know, later. We may show, um, yeah, we'll get to that later, but I had to say that as a man. You did bust your gun, right? Yeah, that's all I wanted to know. They should have shown the fucking little clip of y'all walking in at the beginning. Would have never been none of that, but we'll get to that later. Um, Black Youngster. Was he used and sent and told to be a decoy? Because that's, that, that's, that's what that mean to me. When you stand next to a, a, a tombstone or a, 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 with, with Thornton name on it. Because, you know, you ain't had nothing to do with it. Right? Or did you? Was that a ploy? To throw us off the scent. Um, 
Let's go. All right, straight drop on trial. So um, he got two choices. Take the stand, which they got to bring up all this criminal record and all that. And, and, and uh, after everybody finished telling on his ass or whatever, he still got an option. Take the stand and tell your verse. That'll be your last defense. What y'all think he going to do about that? Because he got to wait on government to come in. Oh, it's going to get deep. All right. Um, this one right here. Who protect, who protect him? What powerhouse is, but if God don't know shit, then who the fuck, if Jay-Z don't know shit, who put them fucking billboards about straight drop in fucking Manhattan? A little bit of promo. Like, huh, I'm going to put your billboard up. Be quiet. I know. We promise you something. Just out of here. I'm mean, just going to do this for you. That shit costs money more than you were because... I don't know nobody that know no straight drop song, right? So that that's just like uh, tells a story in itself. All right, Cornelius lawyer money. Y'all just be looking at that Cornelius got eight hundred dollars and he he painted himself a picture like, um, you know, I was going through a lot, be popping them pills, and uh, I was just a junkie and I just needed some money and I just killed off on on my daughter's birthday because she. Uh, I was trying to get back my baby mama and uh, go van uh, set me up with straight drop and uh, yeah so that's another narrative where his money come from did he get the money did he get the fifty thousand dollars because I was been down to a lot of people it's a lot of people ever seen like damn he just do it like away by eight hundred or oh, y'all paying attention. I don't know. He already testified and said somebody uh, got him fifty thousand dollars to pay for his lawyer. Is what he's saying. I got paid fifty thousand eight hundred. Fifty thousand went to my lawyer. I wonder how they uh, got that money to him to get a lawyer. But I think the feds already know somebody being protected. But let go. These are just notes. Um, Cornelius got shot. Like I told y'all, one of my strong points. I already told y'all. Didn't even know drop. First of all, I didn't know that. But I already knew. So if he be already telling you he got shot with a bullet wound, not a graze, inside your body. He told y'all he passed out, blacked out in the bathroom because he was losing a lot of blood. Why we don't hear about the fucking, where, where Quick told him to go in South Haven where he got arrested at, to the Methodist. Right? Because you can't put peroxide on a fucking bullet wound. You're going to bleed out. Something is going on. And that was just a few notes. So um, let's get back to the trial. You know, like, share, subscribe. I always support. Uh, cash out the sign. True result number two. And let's just get it. Let's just make it to the end. Right now, I'm just doing it the proper way. And I appreciate everybody. Shout out to uh, Kenny K, Papi. The people that just like to stay safe, bro. <laughs> they unwavering. Because they already know it wasn't easy. But we had to do it. So I ain't finna try to do no conspiracy, nothing. These are just my notes. Respect the game. And nobody tell us shit. True.